Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel where it's my opinion or no opinion at all. Scottalicious McFabulous here and I hope that you are feeling Percy. And today we are heading to Coach Retail for the in-store look at some of the most recent handbag releases, most of which are perfect for holiday 2023. But listen, oh, uh, wait, oh, hold, hold, anyone hold, else hold, saw hold, the fish? Hold. Wait, you gonna let me speak? No, anyone else saw the fish net? But before we hop into the Coach Retail Shop With Me trip, if you guys love handbags, hauls, coach luxury the whole lot of those please hit the subscribe button if you are new and if you guys enjoyed today's content make sure you hit that like button as it does help me know you enjoy today's video and it helps with that ever changing ever growing youtube al go rhythm <laughs> Now y'all know exactly what time it is. It's time to get Percy at Coach Retail with some of their brand new releases. Featuring Harleys, the Stars, and the Rexies. And sequins. Can't forget about the sequins. First up though, does go to the Harleys. The Harley Shoulder Bag 23. I'm gonna say, even though I highly dislike the bag design itself, the quality of the leather was immaculate. Absolutely what I want to see from Coach when it comes to their leather goods. An impressive piece in that manner. And, you know, the hardware is good. I just, I don't like what they did for the hardware. I'm not a big fan of it. This one says a genuine gloved hand leather. Okay. A little different from the original gloved hand leather that they just stamped other bags with. I wonder if there's actually a difference between the two. Because I don't think there actually is. And this one also obviously comes with its like a extra long strap. Please do my Newton in the background. I cannot get him to settle down. And something else I noticed with this bag is that it has that goat leather on the inside and then the outer shell would be like the gloved hand leather. Regardless, both are really nice. $550 Canadian plus tax. Kind of expensive. Not even kind of. I feel like that's really expensive, but at least it's nice in the quality department. And it looks all right with my outfit. I'm rocking my mom's favorite bag in my handbag hand bag collection, sorry. Um, the Christian Dior Dice Gambler. With my leopard fur jacket. Well, long coat. And the next up would be the Harley Crossbody Bag. This one is the black. Again, same with this one. It has amazing quality. Genuine glove tan leather stamped at the bottom. No really, like no complaints actually, like when it comes to the quality. Like, at all. Just not in a fan of the bag. $610. So again, we're getting up there with prices. And the clasp on this one is good. The crossbody, I should say. I noticed that with the shoulder bag clasp, it didn't open and close um, as sturdy as you wanted it to. It was very loose. And that could just be coming down to the fact that the flap doesn't go all the way down. Out of the two, I do like the crossbody best. Kind of looks a bit classier. A little more sophisticated. Mm -hmm. 
And then here we got the Burnished Amber and Sport Red. Sport Red is probably my favorite of the color choices besides black. It looks very sharp. And then the classic brown color, of course. And like I said, the flap on the shoulder bag itself, the clasp is not sturdy. And I did test it on the couple of bags that was there. And then here is the chalk color. All of them come with the bronzed hardware. And then surprisingly, the star bag has two iterations, not just the silver, but also black. So it matches my moon bag behind me. I like the mirror bag pieces for like the fun aspect. It distorts your face, kind of like a free little distortion effect on the go. <laughs> but the bottom of this star bag, it was not cute. Like that lumping should not be there. Just my opinion though. Zipper was very easy to use, thankfully, but it, it, it suffers from that claustrophobic hand thing when you're trying to open your bag and it's just not opening. $430 Canadian. So not like a horrible price. I don't know what makes the mirror bags so much more expensive than like the glove tan leather bags, but ooh, okay, go off, I guess. But I actually do like the Black Star. The Black Star is a really cute addition to the bunch. And in all honesty, um, it, like if I had the money, I'd probably add this one to the moon bag. Just for matching purposes. And I did see somebody say in my comment section for my last video where I discussed the whole collection. Um, yeah, I did just drop the bag. <laughs> I dropped the bag. Oops. But they said they wanted to double pair it as a crossbody. So like... Uh, moon on the right and like star on the left and I think that's actually a really good idea that would look sick in the best way possible of course <laughs> just a nice cute little accent piece this one will probably fit a lot more than the moon bag though I'm not gonna lie <laughs> the moon bag fits diddly squat And the next up goes to the sequins. The beautiful sequin pieces. This is like a magenta. Magenta. The magenta color is actually quite nice though. Like I, I really hate that we're trying to make pink. Pink a holiday color. Like ma'am, uh, enough is enough. No, we're not making pink a Christmas color. Not in my household. It is not happening. But it's a beautiful color. Would have been perfect for fall, actually. But nevertheless, I do how it like I, I do how it has like a nice pink, uh, like microfiber suede on the inside. Five hundred and twenty dollars for the studio baguette with sequins. Quite expensive. I do like how it shines perfectly on camera. Like, it does catch light very nicely. It's a very pretty bag. It's a very nice party bag. Perfect for New Year, actually. And then the studio in, like, the Studio 12, I think this is, in sequins is also really cute. But not cute for $270. Like, ma'am, that is a lot of money. That is a lot of money.
And trying to get that back in there was a little tough with the sequence catching onto the, the price tag. <laughs> Black microfiber suede on the inside for this. And then it also has the coach stamp on the inside. So we do like to see that it has the story creed. At least there's that. <laughs> And then behind it is the black studio baguette with sequins, of course. We are going to try this one on as I like the black best. Don't think it would be something I would buy. I mean, like maybe if I found it at like the outlet or something, I would buy it. Maybe. But for the most part, it's it's OK. Next up, though, we do take off to Cosmic Coach with the star print pen shoulder bag. Again, I, the leather on this is really nice. Like, I love the leather. Someone did say in my last video as well that these should be glow-in-the-dark stars. And I could not agree more because that would be a quite a fast selling point, honestly. And... It, it's a beautiful bag nonetheless, though. Like, it, the leather is really nice. Um, the construction really good. $340, though. It's a small bag. It is a really, really, really small bag. I would prefer to see this in the swinger bags, as I said in my previous video. Beautiful turn lock and everything, but too much money lastly though we do move on to the cosmic coach wallets the zip around billfold wallets pretty cute i do like the star print and the rexy print um i do like the rexy print most i really like that rexy print i might actually um I, I might treat myself and get myself that wallet. I don't know. It depends because it is quite expensive at $210 Canadian. So like, uh, eh, it's kind of expensive, you guys. But I do really, really like it. The Rexy with a ray gun is just iconic. It fulfills my video game nerd fantasy mixed with my fashionista fantasy and ah, I'm having a hard time trying to talk myself out of it it's a beautiful piece mostly for the art there can be a hundred people in a room maybe there is right now and 99 don't believe in you but all you need is just for one person to believe. There can be a hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred, hundred people, hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred, 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 or a thousand, nine thousand, or nine nine hundred ninety nine. There can be a hundred people in the Alrighty, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed today's little coach retail shop with me trip. They're okay. There's some decent bags here. Like, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I'm not gonna sit here and harp on them or anything. I just, uh, I feel like I'm a little over the sequins. I like the Rexy stuff, but like, there's just, I'm probably gonna pass on most, if not all, of this stuff in all honesty. Like, just not my vibe but the prints are cute and the sequins do look like they're sewn on pretty decently so it's all right on that front but anyways if you guys did enjoy today's coach retail shop with me trip please hit the subscribe button if you are new hit that like button share with your friends and family come with me any type of opinion you may or may not have had on today's coach retail shop with me trip outfit of the day or kitty delicious moment of the day as well you can always support me and the channel directly by sending me a very generous super thanks donation and you can check out the description box below for the three lucky links to my instagram facebook and discord notification squad i love you all to the absolute moon and back and i'll see you all in my next video Bye!
I think it was good. I don't, I don't. I'm done. I'm done. Oh, no. Show's <laughs> over. Show's <laughs> over. See you next Taco Tuesday, bitch.